Hello, I'm Tom Cox. I'm a volunteer here at the American Heritage Museum in Hudson, Massachusetts. Behind me you see a tank with a very unique camouflage pattern. This is an M4 Sherman Easy 8. This pattern was applied because during Operation Ritter, which was going to take place in March of 1951 in Korea, they realized that it was the year of the tiger on the uh, Chinese zodiac calendar. And they figured based on superstitions that the Chinese and the North Koreans would find it bad luck to kill a tiger dur during the year of the tiger. So they painted up many of these Sherman tanks along with some Chaffee tanks and some Pershing tanks in various stages of camouflage, making them look like roaring tigers or dragons. The thought was the enemy would be scared, run away, or just not want to kill a tiger during the year of the tiger. Great idea for psychological warfare, except for one minor detail. While they were planning this, it was the year of the tiger, but by the time the operation kicked off in March, the Zodiac calendar had changed, and it was no longer the year of the tiger, it was now the year of the rabbit. So I'm not sure painting a rabbit on the front of these tanks would have the same psychological effect, but it is a very unique pattern. Shortly after Operation Ritter, the tanks were painted back to their normal uh, green coloring, and this unique camouflage was gone. But if you'd like to see this very unique camouflage pattern, along with many other unique and rare artifacts, please come visit us at the American Heritage Museum in Hudson, Massachusetts. We are open Wednesday through Sundays. We hope to see you soon. I'm Tom Cox. Thank you for watching.